Hello everyone, welcome back to the Headphonia YouTube channel. And in this video today, we will be looking at the AudioQuest Dragonfly. Those of you who don't know the AudioQuest Dragonfly, it's a USB dongle sized DAC amp, which you just plug in to your laptop and it's, uh, it gives you really good sound. It's very popular. And this is actually one of the first Dragonflies that came out, so we will not be looking at this one today. But we will be talking about these ones. This is the Dragonfly Red and Black, as you can see. I've got two versions of the Red. I'll tell you in a minute why. And the reason why we're talking about this is because a few months ago, AudioQuest um, released an update. And from that update on, you are able to listen to MQA music from Tidal, an example. So in this video today, we'll show you how you can check which version you have of your Dragonfly. We'll show you how you can very easily update it with the AudioQuest tool. And then we'll show you how you have to do the correct settings in Tidal in order to get the uh, MQA uh, to your Dragonfly. So let's get started. I published the uh, AudioQuest Dragonfly Red and Black review about a year and a half ago. And up to today, it's still one of the reviews that people still ask me questions about. And uh, looking at our Google stat, it's uh, still one of the most read reviews on the site. But okay, let's get started. So first of all, we go to audioquest.com slash digital updates. You scroll down a bit where you have to select your operating system. Then you have to accept the terms and click the software download button. Once you have downloaded and run the installation file, the only thing left to do is click the AudioQuest device manager icon on your desktop and it will run the program. You will get to this screen where you basically see that you need to insert your device. So that's what we'll do now. And then automatically it will tell you what version it is of the firmware um, your uh, Dragonfly is running on. So at this time, your uh, LED in the Dragonfly will start blinking. If you want to update it, you just click the Update Now button. And then it will only take a few seconds till it's updated to, to the latest version, 1.06. And you will be ready to process the MQA, MQA via Tidal. In this picture, you can see both of my Dragonflies. The bottom one is showing an orange LED. And this one hasn't been updated to the latest firmware, which supports uh, MQA. The top one has been updated, so it's on the 1.06. It's been configured correctly in Tidal, and the LED logo is now more or less kind of purple. So this is really what you want. You want your Dragonfly to display the purple LED when you're playing MQA in Tidal. So to do that, you just have to set up Tidal correctly, and I'll show you how to do that right now. When all that is done, you go to your Tidal software. You just have to make sure that your updated Dragonfly is connected, of course. You go to the file and the settings menu. You click on the streaming tab where you, of course, you have to make sure that you have a paid uh, subscription for the masters. You select the AudioQuest Dragonfly as output. You click the setup wheel and there you just have to set use exclusive mode that's all you have to do you can come back and close it then you simply browse to where they are storing the master files you can pick any album you like i'll just pick the first one click play and once the song is loaded your dragonfly should be showing the purple led and that means that you're streaming mqa from Tidal. that's it for this video do make sure to read the written text that goes with this video because AudioQuest and us have prepared a little surprise for you. Thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe to our channel and we'll see you soon again for another Watch It Wednesday video. Bye.